Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. What are Medicaid income limits? Medicaid income limits vary depending on the state and the specific Medicaid program you are applying for. Here's a breakdown of the key aspects. Federal Poverty Level, FPL. Medicaid eligibility often uses the federal poverty level as a benchmark. For 2024, the FPL for an individual is $15,060, and for a family of four, it is $31,200. States that have expanded Medicaid coverage typically allow individuals with incomes up to 138% of the FPL to qualify for Medicaid. MAGI and non-MAGI categories. There are two main categories for determining Medicaid eligibility, modified adjusted gross income, MAGI, and non-MAGI. MAGI applies to most non-disabled adults and children under 65, including pregnant women, dependent children, and parents or caretaker relatives of children under 19. For these individuals, the income limit is often set at 138% of the FPL. Non-MAGI applies to individuals who are 65 or older, disabled, blind, or those needing long-term care. For these groups, the income limits are different and often higher. In New York, for example, the non-MAGI income limits for 2024 are $1,732 per month for a single person and $2,350 per month for a married couple, both spouses applying. State-specific limits. Income limits can vary significantly by state. For instance, in New York for 2024, single, $1,732 per month. Married, both spouses applying, $2,351 per month. Married, one spouse applying, $1,732 per month for the applicant. Countable income. Most income sources are counted towards these limits, including salaries, pensions, social security income, social security disability income, gifts, annuity payments, IRA distributions, and alimony. However, some income source sources are exempt, such as VA aid and attendance benefits and Holocaust restitution payments. Asset limits. In addition to income limits, Medicaid also has asset limits. In New York for 2024, single, $31,175. Married, both spouses applying, $42,312. Married, one spouse applying, $31,175 for the applicant, with a range of $74,820 to $154,140 for the non-applicant spouse. Look-back period. Medicaid also has a look-back period to scrutinize asset transfers. For institutional Medicaid, there is a 60-month look-back period. A new 30-month look-back period for community Medicaid is set to begin, possibly as early as March 31, 2024, but likely delayed until 2025. Special considerations. For individuals in nursing homes, nearly all of their income must go towards the cost of care. Except for a personal needs allowance, typically $50 per month, Medicare premiums, and in some cases, a needs allowance for a non-applicant spouse. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.